All right, guys, so we all know that we are building up to Marvel Studios Avengers Secret Wars. This is going to be the big saga capping event. The next, well, second next Avengers movie, uh, because, of course, we're also getting Avengers the Kang Dynasty, but they're both coming 2025. They're both going to be the conclusion to Phase 6. They're both going to be the conclusion to the multiverse saga of the MCU. So, of course, everybody is talking about Avengers Secret Wars. Kang Dynasty 2, but more so Secret Wars, because, of course, this is the big one we've all been theorizing about for a while now. Secret Wars is happening. Now, Kang Dynasty does have a director with Destin Daniel Cretton who did Shang-Chi, but when it comes to Secret Wars, there's been no update on who's going to be directing Avengers Secret Wars. Obviously, we know the Russo brothers have shown plenty of interest. Kevin Feige said that they're not going to be doing it, though. There's been rumors possibly Ryan Coogler could be doing it. So the whole director position for Secret Wars is still up in the air. But today we did just get confirmation of who's going to be writing the script. And this is pretty interesting because we do know also who's going to be writing the script for Kang Dynasty. I don't know the guy, so I didn't do a video on it. It's not really that big news. But this is because it is Michael Waldron, who you probably recognize that name because he's uh, he's pretty trusted by Marvel Studios at this point. Now, after writing all six episodes of the Loki Disney Plus series, I'm not sure if he returned for season two. I'm assuming he did. But then again, I don't, I don't know that for a fact. So already... Got some huge confidence in this guy. I mean, the Loki Disney Plus series. Sure, I still prefer WandaVision out of all the MCU series. But Loki is probably the best written Disney Plus series. And just the best series overall. I just had more fun personally with WandaVision. So, already huge confidence in this guy after Loki. But he also wrote Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. Which, um, yeah, his writing for that was definitely heavily critiqued and I'll admit myself that it's the the writing was a bit sloppy in places particularly in the scene with the Illuminati but that that's why this is kind of a controversy because when this news came out I was kind of confused because like everybody's been hating on this guy for the last couple months after what he did to Multiverse of Madness and so the, for him to be in charge of Secret Wars the next big one I was kind of surprised by that but when you actually look at the reality of it, look at that amazing, beautiful work he did on Loki, and then kind of think about what happened with Doctor Strange. Why is this so low in quality compared to what we got with Loki with his work there? Well, the reason is because with Multiverse of Madness, he didn't have the time. Loki, he had months and months. I, I honestly don't know how long he was working on that, but he put a lot of time and effort into those scripts for the Loki Disney Plus series. Plus, that was also a six-episode series. This was a movie that he had to completely rewrite an entirely new version of the script from scratch in three weeks. Because they had originally a different script, but he had to completely start over from scratch with really just like some good ideas from the former script. He had to change it because Nightmare was originally going to be the villain, so he had to change it to Wanda being the villain, bring in all this multiverse stuff, bring in the Illuminati, doing all that stuff. So it's understandable why Multiverse of Madness didn't work out very well for him because he had to do all of that in three weeks. You can't expect a masterpiece out of somebody in three weeks on this kind of scale. So it's fully understandable. And like, if you're going to judge his work, judge Loki. I mean, if you didn't like Loki, then you have every right to be infuriated by this choice. But I loved Loki. Multiverse Madness was lower in quality, but Loki was his full range of talent on display there. And especially with this Secret Wars, I mean... They're probably not going to start filming that until at least late 2023, 2024 ish. Um, so he has like a year, at least a year to write this script. So he has time. He's got all the time in the world to do Secret Wars. So I'm not at all concerned about this. I'm actually super excited about this because some of the things he did so well in Loki was relating to the TVA and the multiverse, which of course is what Secret Wars is all about. And you know, I actually, there were some parts of Multiverse Madness that I think the writing was really, really well done. And then there were other parts where it wasn't. So again, it's just about timing. And like, you give him the time, he can turn out a masterpiece like he did with Loki 
you give them three weeks and then you get what happened with multiverse madness so i'm pretty happy about this i'm excited about this choice michael waldron i think he's a great writer he does not deserve all the hate he got for multiverse madness the odds were against him with that uh but i'm excited for this uh, hopefully we find out about the director sometime soon um but then again we don't necessarily have to because this movie's years away but at the same time also kind of right around the corner so anyways guys let me know your thoughts in the comments below what do you think about this news that michael waldron will be the writer for marvel studios of Avengers Secret Wars. Are you infuriated by this news? Like, oh no, he did a terrible job with Multiverse of Madness and that's going to be terrible. Or are you like me? Like, he did, turned out a masterpiece with Loki. This is going to be great. So anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching. Please drop a like if you enjoyed this video and hit the subscribe button so I can keep you to date on everything goes on in the Marvel life.